Minga la ba kumya. I'm Angus Watson with the top stories for DVB. Fierce fighting broke out around Pakan on Thursday morning between Burmese government forces and the Kachin Independence Army. Hundreds of civilians are reported to have fled their homes as a result of the clashes. The firefights follow the brief detention of a regional government minister by the KIA on Wednesday. Three policemen were detained alongside Kaman Du Noor, the Kachin Minister for Transport. They are still being held. Tin Lin U, a former senior figure in the National League for Democracy, apologised to over 30 monks at a police station in central Burma on Thursday. In a speech in October, the popular author criticised the use of the religion as a cover for prejudice and discrimination. His remarks drew the ire of hardline Buddhist monks and he lost his position in the NLD. In December, he was charged with offending religion and remains in prison and he, as his case continues. The monks are reported to have accepted his apology. Thursday is the first day of Naga New Year. It is a time when Naga from across northwestern Burma come together to celebrate their harvests and pray for another good year of health. The majority of Naga tribes are situated in Chin State, with some spreading out into Sagain Division. Naga are perhaps best known for their tradition as fierce warriors. The group have historically been headhunters. <laughs> Burmese art is set to premiere in the New York art scene. A three-month exhibition titled Buddhist Art of Myanmar will open at the Asia Society Museum on the 10th of February. Over 70 exhibits will feature, some dating back as far as the 5th century. The landmark event will include pieces created for temples, monasteries and personal devotion, most of, most of which have never been shown outside of Myanmar. A series of related events has also been planned to coincide with the exhibition. That will include rare performances of Zap Bue, a Burmese tradition which combines elements of song, dance, comedy, puppetry and drama. You can find more on all of these stories at dvb.no. Bye for now.